because it can mm -hmm. be a little bit overwhelming. Can you hold this? Mm -hmm. I'll try to do it better this week. So you get this kit and it's covered like this. It comes with this stuff, this. What I do is I take it all out and flip it over. When I flip it over, I sit. Okay, hold on. Let's get a picture. It's powder. You said it, well, you say powder, but it won't do anything, so it's really compact. You set that right there, set that right there, and that's all still wrapped, so I can set it right there. Then you have this, and that's a big, yeah, where I fracture my finger. Nothing grows. I've washed my hands. But um, you have this, and what you do is you get that off. Then you can set that to the side. And if you hear a dark dog crying, ignore it. It's spoiled and we won't let it in here when we do embroil. And then you got this. It's called the adapter. What the adapter does is it gently goes on there. And the adapter is made to do this. Because if you use the needle to go through here, if you do other shots, you know this. The more you do that, the duller the needle gets. So then that's why I heard method tricks. I sometimes hurt if I have to go into vials and get it because it gets duller. But that has a pointed thing. So we pop it on there. Put the medicine in the powder. Well, first you turn this. We don't want to overturn it. And I have a big tendency to do that and overturn it and some will leak out if it's not in here so that's why I wait to put that on there once I get this already in because if I do it opposite I've leaked some of the liquid out before so I do that to be safe but squeeze it all in you'll most people won't leave it on there when it's done it but you see that hard powder just became liquidy with white on it you want to mix it, but it says no shaking Somebody it. asked, what are you mixing? Well, answer them. I don't know. Really? Embryl powder. Embryl kit. So you twirl it slowly. No mixing. I mean, no shaking. Yeah. Are you and a lot of people say they take it out and put it into insulin needles so it don't hurt at all. But we've been told strictly by Embryl and our doctor not to do that because it breaks down the medicine so yes it is embryo so it doesn't work as good but some people do it you just do whatever your doctor tells you if they say you can do it you can do it but we go embryo it looks large but it really don't hurt the needle is bit, i mean she gets to use an insulin needle for her methotrexate this is the actual needle part since i took when I pop this off the adapter and that, that'll be trash for us now. But yeah, the needle is longer, but she's like anti-methotrexate. So she, even though it's an insulin needle, she gets to use with it. She'd rather do this big needle, bigger needle. Tell them about my B12 needles. They're ginormous. They're like an inch and a half. Because I want muscle to get it needle. into the muscle. B12 is not something I'm prescribed. Well, I guess I am, but it's not like a medicine I have to have. I do it for energy because my lupus just leaves me wiped out. Okay, but this is how you mix it, and I'm going to let her sign off of that and come back on and do her video of yeah. her own because... This is part yeah. one, and we're going to have a part two. She, she didn't want me to impede on her time. Bye. Bye.